Hello everyone, Sydney Storm here, balloon maker, eccentric entertainer, and so much more. And today we are going to be learning how to twist a frog. So stay tuned. So to get started with the frog, it's pretty easy. You don't put a ton of air in the balloon. We're talking just, mm, I don't know, about eight inches or so, maybe even a little less. Let a little bit air out so it's pliable there. And what I like to do, this whole thing is gonna be our frog. We're gonna go ahead and start with the eyes on the front of it. We're gonna go ahead and do like maybe two one inch bubbles, just like that, two one inch bubbles. Fold them together, take the tie off, and twist it right to the bottom of the last bubble you did. You get this situation here, but we're not done yet. Go ahead and stretch that out. Don't be afraid, cover that, pull that up and over that top section, twist it around a few times and look, you get yourself the eyeballs. These are gonna be the eyeballs of our frog, okay? And the rest of it here, this section is gonna be the body. We're gonna go ahead and make our four little feet. We'll do kind of the same thing on the other end. We're gonna twist two one inch bubbles, connect it from here to here. You can see these two sections here. Imagine that line going straight down this section. Twist them both together, one, two, three, or so. And I like to take this and connect the piece to right, right through here, just push it right through. Again, you'll get the hang of it with these balloons. It just takes a little bit of practice. Now with the front feet, we're gonna take what's left, the last, the last little bubble piece, we'll go ahead and twist straight down the middle like this, give it a twist. And again, if you like what we're doing here, please go ahead and click like and subscribe and go ahead and bing, hit that bell icon so you get our most up-to-date videos and stick around for our question of the day. But right here, we're gonna go ahead and take the tail part, wrap it right around here, two, three, and we're left sort of with this situation. So I like to take what's left of the tail and pull that straight through the side we were just on. So we get four wacky bubbles at the bottom and it's a matter of straightening it all out. If you stick with me, we have a little tool, a little pair of scissors just, just right here behind the camera. We'll get this off of here. Huh, I'm back. I go ahead and cut that little section right off. Oh, ping. Okay. And then we get these, th these little feces here. And this is our frog. But I don't like to stop just there. Usually with the frogs, I do like to draw a face on it so they look a little more frog-like. Whoop. Uh, go ahead and put those eyeballs on it so it's a little googly-eyed, a little bit, kind of. Little tongue and mouth. There we go, so we got the eyes on the frog. And then on the back, kind of do an upside-down Y shape and about three or four little bubbles, or little dots, I mean. Three, four, five, six, seven, could be a dozen if you want. Little dots on the end. And bada-boom, bada-bing, we have ourselves... A really neat little frog to hop around. So he hops around. He's really, really fun. So do you happen to have a favorite amphibian? That is our question of the day. That's right. Do you happen to have a favorite, like, uh, you know, lizard or you know, we did a dragon in a previous video, something like that that you would like to see me make for you or that you make yourself, please go ahead and comment below. We'd love to hear from you. Again, please click like and subscribe. My name is Sydney Storm, and thank you so much for learning how to make a frog with us today on Twisters.